Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and today in this video I'm gonna show, how to install macOS Ventura on PC, or a laptop, having Intel or AMD processor. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, so, let's begin. For this purpose, you'll require macOS Ventura installer, to download the installer, follow the guide for my button, command text, for creating bootable USB, open core configurator for mounting ESP, EFI according to your target hardware. A proper guide for preparing EFI has already been published, and a link for it will be in the description. Also, one USB with a minimum of 16 gigabytes is required. Now, plug in your USB, and you can see the USB appeared. Now, open Disk Utility, and erase the drive with following parameters. After USB is erased, click on Done, and close Disk Utility. Now, open Command Text and copy the whole command, and then open Terminal. Paste the whole command and press Enter key. Enter the password, and also confirm erasing the USB. Click on OK, if Terminal requests permission, and wait until the process gets finished. After the process gets finished, close terminal, and now, mount EFI partition of USB using open core configurator. After mounting the ESP, copy EFI of the target system, and paste it to EFI partition of USB. After copying the EFI, copy Open Core Configurator, and paste it to USB. After pasting, eject the USB. And now, power on your target PC, and boot to BIOS. Here, load BIOS defaults, and exit BIOS saving changes, your PC will restart. Boot back to BIOS. And now, Change the following settings. After making the changes, exit BIOS saving changes, and after your PC reboots, Boot to boot menu. From here, select your USB, followed by the UEFI prefix, and press enter to boot. And from here, select, install Mac OS 13 beta, and press enter to boot, and wait till it boots to the installer. From here, select your preferred language, and click on right arrow button. Now, Select Disk Utility, and click on Continue. Here, click on View, and then click on Show All Devices. Now select your main drive instead of any partitions, and click on Erase button, and erase the drive with the following parameters. After erasing the drive, close Disk Utility, and now select, Install Mac OS Monterey and click on Continue, and proceed with the installer.
Here, select the drive you created, and then click on continue. Keep in mind that the installation process may take a while, depending on your USB, and drive speed. And during the installation, your PC will restart several times, so don't worry about it. And finally, Ventura setup screen is here. Set up your Mac OS according to your preferences. After coming to the desktop, we need to make the PC boot to Mac OS independently, without further requiring the USB for that open USB, and then open Open Core Configurator. Now mount the ESP of drive and USB as well, enter password when prompt. Now, copy the EFI folder from USB, and paste it to EFI partition of hard drive. After copying, close the folder and eject EFI partitions, and restart your PC. And now, we don't need USB for booting to Mac OS. And now, I'll quickly show you that what's working, and the hardware specification. So, that was it, macOS has been successfully installed, and working as expected. Hope it was useful, consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you have any question, just comment down below, thanks for watching, and have a great day ahead.